Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be how I organized under my sink. It's also a collaboration I'm doing with two of the mamas from the Mama Mixer, Shirley from Life is a Twin Mom and Lee Hao from Lulu Bao. So make sure you go check them out. Their link will be in the description box below. Here's another one of my lovely before shots. Nothing had a place and everything was just chaos. We're going to fix that right now. So I guess I'm going to start with this section over here and try to move little by little. This is the Lazy Susan that I made from the uh, rounds from the Dollar Tree. I have two of them together with the marbles and then the washi tape on the inside. This has all of my hair products. Um, it has like some scrubs and some body oils. But it allows me to spin it so that I can get to the things that I need. And it just makes it super convenient because I used to keep everything in that little thing right there. But now I can get to everything and it's easy to get to. On here I have hair tools written in a chalkboard label but I'm really happy with the way that everything is contained. In this magazine rack I have my blow dryer, a brush that I use when I blow dry my hair, and my straightener. Coming over here to these two bins I have one for hair stuff and then one for body care stuff. So body wash, body lotions. Uh, there is some suntan lotion in there. Uh, so I just keep add anything that I use in there. Of course I have the hair stuff on the top because I am going to use that more often. Um, and then this stuff is really just like extra stuff. So of course we have this pipe in the middle, which most people have, and it's kind of hard to organize under there, but um, I like the way that these two separate bins worked out. Um, if you can see, these ones are taller and these ones are shorter so it did work out really nice because this one is a little bit wider than that one. On this side I have my stockpile of goodies that I've been collecting. So I have an air curler, I have my nose strips, I have um, the, the shampoo, an extra Maybelline color tattoo, the extra Tokyo um, makeup brushes. So anything that's just extra, I labeled it my stockpile because I can just let the things collect here. I have extra washcloths. So that is this side that I, I guess I would use it, you know, it, everything that I need is accessible. This side that I'm going to show you next is the side that I use the most often because it houses my makeup. Um, I wanted to figure out something where I could keep my makeup, still get to it, and have it organized. Where it's not really organized, but it's not all over the place, so an organized mess. So I did take this apart. This used to have three drawers. I took the one part apart and just have the two drawers. Up here I keep my everyday makeup, so things that I like to use on an everyday basis. And on the bottom shelf down there I keep things that are extra. So extra eyeshadows, um, things that I don't wear that often, just things that are just extra that I don't like to reach for every single day. At the very top here I have a bag. I have Up here I have... Um, what is that? Up here I have a basket for makeup bags. So any type, type of traveling bag, makeup bag, um, bags that go in your pocketbook, I just put those in there. Um, I did get this rack from Deals and it was $5 and I think that it raises it up nicely. I don't know if it's going to stay there. This is the extra drawer and I keep the cleaning stuff in there. Things that you don't need that often. But I know that keeping the cleaning stuff in the front, my husband will be able to get to it really easily when he wants to clean out the bathtub or whatever. So down at the bottom, we have um, nose suckers, castor oil from when I had it before, um, an extra first aid kit, any uh, sprays that we need for cuts and burns, I keep that right there. I also have a bigger one that lives behind here, but we don't go into that one that often, so I just stuck it back there. And that is really everything that is underneath the cabinet. I do have a medicine cabinet up at the top where I keep like face wash, deodorant, things that I use more often. But I am really happy with the way that the makeup stuff turned out. So that is the under the sink storage that I did from the Dollar Tree. Mostly everything is from the Dollar Tree. The bins, the baskets, mostly everything except for this, this rack right here and the magazine rack. Now for comparison, here is the before and the after. Hi guys, I hope that you get a chance to check out Shirley and Lee House channel. They are both doing different organizational videos. Leave any tips and tricks that you guys have because I sure do need them. Thank you so much for watching. If you aren't subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button because it will make me happy and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.